that's a lot. Should we be concerned? Uh, I don't know if you can one. even see that. But um, yeah, here we are. What are we doing? Just got to the Fort Wilderness. Fort, the what? <laughs> Fort Wilderness Lodge. We <laughs> can't talk. And we are about to go grab dinner at Storybook. Yes, yeah. I'm excited. Also, it yeah. looks like it's going to storm. Like, what is happening? Yeah. Um, now I'm a little concerned. Um, but no, yeah, very excited. This is a very well sought after reservation. So I'm yeah. excited that we have this. Hopefully, Pretty, I think it's arguably one of the hardest reservations to get. Mm -hmm. So when we planned our Christmas trip a long time ago, as soon as it hit the uh, 60 day mark, uh, or is it 90? I forget. Three, 60. yeah, two months. No, three months is 90, two months is 60. Anyways, whenever we could plan, we booked like immediately. Um, so very excited. Looked at the menu, looks great, heard great things. Yeah. So I hope you guys enjoy too. Excited to check it out. Guys, I think this one takes the cake. <laughs> How many trees have we seen in a day? That there she days. goes. Holy mm. cow. I, there's got to be something that says how tall it is. I'm not sure. It's very cute in here, guys. This is actually my first time ever being in here. Yeah, this same. really cool. Yeah, I'm really excited. I feel like this is one of those um, giant cabins you rent with a bunch of people and <laughs> Airbnb it out. I love it. I'm excited. This is Crush. They have done a great job in here. This is cool. Wow, that sun is bright. Yeah, this is really cool. Very cute. I love it. Maybe we'll stay here next Christmas. <laughs> Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I feel very small. I'm in the booth side and I feel like this little like mushroom leaf thing that they put, I believe, like I think the appetizers and all that stuff. Uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. On, so they did let us know, we'll scan, um, I think it's a QR code for the, uh, the menu, but you can scan it yourself and follow along. But um, yeah, so they, they pre-select your appetizers and you get pre-selected desserts. The only thing that you do pick is the entree. So, um, yeah, excited to check that out. We've got Margo hopefully acting nice. We've got drinks coming because it has been a day. It's been a day. And Very um, curious to see how Margo acts with the characters. Um, so stay tuned for that one. <laughs> yeah, she knows I'm talking is, about her. The ambiance in here is really, really cool. Yeah. So we have a mushroom bisque. Chicken and turkey meatball, shrimp cocktail. Yes. I'll give it a spin for you guys. We also have, apparently Snow White is making rounds. Oh yeah, here she, she's out there. Yeah, so they told us that when these lights start to flicker, that's how you know that a character is starting to come out. So we'll see, Margot is probably gonna lose her ever-loving mind. She does not care. Margo is zoned into Zootopia and her uh, autographs from the Queen, Dopey, Grumpy, and Snow White. Yes. Margo. Hi ho. It's off to where we go. <laughs> oh, here they come! Go, oh, Margo! You say hey? Woo! 
right, so this is the mushroom bisque. The first bite's really good. It was cool because it had like a, a green floater chive on top. Oil. It's what? Chive oil. Chive oil. It looks almost like kind of a, a potion floating on top, but really cool. And do you know what you're getting yet? Um, no. <laughs> Should I go underneath since you're so short? Dude, I really Or should I'm I go like, up top? Like, I'm literally like <laughs> fully straight, um, so. Yeah. I'm gonna do the uh, prime rib. What is it called again, the royal? Royal prime rib roast, which has horse, horse radish mashed, mashed potatoes, goodness, carrots, and yeah. Yeah. Just be mindful of the horse radish and the mashed potatoes. I'll give those to Marco. Noted. Who it is. You yeah, might Mr. get scared. Mr. Grumpster. <laughs> you say hello? I can't see your face. I want to see oh. Scared. <laughs> She's a crankpot, just like you, Grumpy. Oh, no. <laughs> You're okay. Aw. You're fine. We're a little scared these days. It's okay. <laughs> yeah. This one. Yeah. She's just a baby. Yeah. I know. He's okay. <laughs> he gets it. He's grumpy too. Oh, okay. You're fun. <laughs> Mama, do you want to get in? No, no, no. Margo. Seems to be warming up to Grumpy a little bit. She's taking it in strides. The meatballs were really good. And also, my drink is amazing. It's kind of like the old fashioned. I'll, uh, what is it? A, a brew of peaches, which is Uncle Nearest 1884 small batch whiskey, peach, raspberry, brulee. Denver, yes, but it is really, really good. Probably one of my favorite drinks. This is Uncle Nearest 1884 small batch whiskey, peach, raspberry, brulee, and some sugar that I do not know how to pronounce. But what I wanted to show is on the side it has a little like raspberry jam almost. It is so good to sip off of that. It makes it a little sweet. But yeah, this is hands down probably, this is up there, one of my favorite old fashions. So we're going to unlock our shrimp. Ooh, look at that. So this is Margo's uh, appetizer. We are um, just doing the best we can to get her to eat anything She's at this point. She's these up and dropping them all over the floor. I feel bad for our uh, waitress. She's awesome, by the way. Yeah, she's great. But I feel bad because she's just like, probably knows all over the floor. I'll clean it as much as I can. Yeah. But yeah, Margo's not food motivated, so it's very tough for her to eat or for us to get her to eat, so we're doing our best. But I think she gets mac and cheese, so that is a cool thing that they did just let us know. Um, it's basically like on the house, they can either get mashed potatoes or mac and cheese, so we opt for mac and cheese. We'll see uh, which one of us eats it, me or Weston. <laughs> All right, so our food has arrived. I got the Bashful's Sustainable Fish, which is salmon. I, I, I think it probably changes. Um, it comes with an herb risotto and a gremolata, which is gonna be the uh, the breadcrumbs on top here. And Weston got the Royal Prime Rib Roast, which is horseradish mashed potatoes. I have to show you guys. This looks amazing. Look at that. And this popover thing. This, I mean, so again, our brother-in-law is from uh, the UK and he always makes Yorkshire puddings for us at Thanksgiving and Christmas. This looks like a massive one of those, so very excited. Oh, it's magic. Perfect. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Look at that. Perfect.
perfect time for Grumpy. Margo is uh, also grumpy. <laughs> so my second drink is the Smoking Mirror. It's Johnny Walker Black, which is a 12-year whiskey, wild berry, lime, and rosemary smoke. Now, the smoke is intense. <laughs> so if you don't like smoke, I would not recommend this. So to just mention the smoke, that was very intense. I mean, I literally went out to take a uh, sip. Uh -huh. I felt like it was at a campfire. Really? Yeah, well, isn't it like a flavored smoke. smoke? Yeah. I mean, it's, it's good, but it's just very, very smoky. Uh, if you're a whiskey drinker like me, I would stick to the old-fashioned. Very, very good. Yeah. It's good. Right, I am not a smoky uh, person at all. I don't even like smoked bacon, so not for me. I stuck with, I ended up with a Diet Coke. Also, <laughs> if I have like green stuff in my teeth, whatever, um, it's for my salmon, but I, I went with my bubbles. I'm a big fan of bubbles. I don't think this is Prosecco. I think it's um, Groot. It is a Groot. I think I got the Argyle Groot Delish. It's good. Margo is getting hype on her milk over here, so yeah. Super Katie's Overall, milk. Overall, this has been a, a really great experience. Ditto. Very good. The mean old queen is coming out. <laughs> All that stuff. She's serious. Look at that stuff. Margo, don't learn. <laughs> See that on the plate? That's what we started out with. And that's what we're going to leave with her having eating. <laughs> she will not eat. Your food's good? Very good. What is your favorite part? The steak, the mashed potatoes? The prime rib is really good. But honestly, these mashed potatoes I've like never had this before. It's got the horseradish mixed into it. Yeah. With the potatoes. Mm -hmm. So that has like the tiny little kick to it. It's yeah. It's, it's good. Sounds good. Really good. I'll give you a piece. Um, my salmon is bread? delish. It's like just has the right amount of flavor. Those, uh, the crunchy stuff on top, so good. The risotto, delish. I definitely recommend this dish if you come and you want like something that's not, you know, chicken or steak or pork. Yeah, definitely grab that. So I do just want to let you know that you actually can come over here and you can get pictures with the queen. Um, I think you can get them done professionally. You can have people take them, you know, if you have a cell phone, you want to have them taken. Yeah, pretty neat. We're not doing that because Margot would probably have a heart attack, but um, yeah, definitely very cool. She's very serious. How are you? Hello, she may get scared. <laughs> Good. You say hello. You have a, you have a, a visitor. Say hi. Oh. Yeah. It's okay. It's not you. It's her. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Thank you. You're okay. <laughs> Perfect. All right. One, two, three. Margo. Perfect. Got it. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes. It's not you. She's still in character. That's what it is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Bye bye. All right. So our shared desserts have come out. This is our miner's treasure, which is cookies and cream panna cotta with chocolate gems. Right here we have the poison apple, which is dark chocolate apple mousse with a sour center. And lastly, I can't get it in focus, but we have our fairy tale gooseberry tart, which is meringue and gooseberry. So yeah, excited to try these out. We just finished dinner. I'm waiting for Weston to meet us outside. Uh, we wanted to get Margot calmed down, um, but look how cute this is. I've never seen this before. Obviously I haven't been here for Christmas, but yeah, so few people like us come and, and they bring their own Christmas lights to light up. I think that's so cute. Definitely getting me in the holiday spirit. Man. That was very, very good. It was delicious. Yes, super enjoyed that. We did have to cut filming a bit short, 
Margo was just not having it with the characters. Yeah, uh. I think she's just at that age where like she's just overwhelmed and it kind of stranger danger. It's a whole pro like combination of things and it just yeah. wasn't working. So she still hasn't warmed up quite the character dining yet. Yeah. Um, however, push that aside. Yes. The food, our waiter everything or waitress sorry was absolutely amazing it was a great experience all very around. great experience we'll definitely be back um, 100%. but yeah with that that's going to end it and we will see you guys later yep have a good night bye